Skoda Popular Sport Monte Carlo 1936. In January 1936, Skoda achieved an unusual success in motorsport, the team Stenek Pole, Jaroslav Hausmann was virtually unheard of, however, they finished in second place at the Monte Carlo Rally in the less than 1,500cc class with a modified roadster Skoda Popular. The company seized this opportunity to launch a limited series of sports models with a distinctive design, the Coda Popular Sport Monte Carlo. Exactly 80 years ago, the model celebrated its motor show premiere at the International Motor Show in Paris. Much like the rally car, the customer vehicles also had the more powerful four-cylinder engine under the bonnet, with a 1.4-liter displacement and 23 kilowatts, 31 horsepower, from the Rapid model. The three-speed transmission sat above the rear axle, forming a block with a differential, transaxle system. The model had a top speed of 110 km per hour, and the effective hydraulic brakes completed the sporty disposition of Coda Popular Monte Carlo. In 1936, the base price of the limited edition model was 28.500 crowns, while the standard Roadster Popular 1.0 liters, 16 kilowatts, 22 PS, started at 18,700 crowns. The first two vehicles of the Coda Popular Monte Carlo type were built in July 1936, the last copy, a coup with dark gray metallic paint was delivered on January 13, 1939. Of the 70 cars produced, 24 were roadsters in a lighter version with simpler equipment. In addition, 17 comfortable roadsters were produced with handle-operated side windows instead of the attachment windows. 23 coups, 2 convertibles, 2 chassis for the individual body construction and 2 suspension variants and a range of engines completed the series. There were two roadsters that were particularly luxurious, which the Czechoslovak government sent to the Yugoslavian head of state in 1938, the then 14-year-old King Peter II. Karador Devic. Discerning private customers could opt for the two-seater coupe Skoda Popular Monte Carlo, which cost 35,000 crowns. It was 4.20 meters long, 1.50 meters wide and 1.37 meters high weighing in at 960 kilograms. In October 1937, the facelift model went on sale, its characteristics included a modified suspension and tuning, as well as a longer wheelbase. The compact body featured many aspects of the then streamlined design, the headlights were partially embedded in the wings. Among the prominent clients were the popular actor of the Prague theater Novin Rydkita Markal Erbler, 